of youth or a tree <laughs> that I should First visit? Of all, you have a show. I have a show. <laughs> remember, remember, I was on. I was on the Today Show, and this was before it was announced, and it was in the works, and nobody knew. And you and Kathy were like, "You should have a By TV the show." Way, and I was like, "No." We, we, but I have to say, we predicted you did. Kelly was going to have a show a long time ago. I thought you were nuts. You showed up yeah. on our set, and you lit the place up like nobody oh. ever had. Well, and, and I didn't forget it. And I remember thinking, like, what's going to happen? And when Kathy Lee was leaving, remember? Yes. We were like, what's going to happen? We were unclear. I know. And here's the sad thing. Like, I was like, wait, I didn't realize at the time that she was leaving. And yeah. I was like, I could have maybe gone to work with you. I was like, what? And then I was like, wait, you wake up really early. <laughs> I was like, this nope. Is, you've been, I have to tell you, we watch you all the time. Thank you've you. been amazing. I love and I'm it. so happy for you. I can't even express. And now you work with my other Texas queen, Jenna. Come on. Yes. Jenna yes. Bushager is crazy. So funny. And so fun. The Texan. <laughs> so welcome. But wait, one yeah. reason why I'm yeah. glad you're here yeah. is well, hashtag wine. Let's do this. Yeah. Hashtag wine? Yep, yep. I mean, because you get to drink on your show. So. And here's what I want to toast. Okay. This is actually pretty cool. Let's toast from my friends at Agni Wine. Okay. okay it's um, it's a Matt Morris. I think it's called Charbonneau. Look at you. Uh, no, oh, it's so French. Um, I don't even know what it is. And it's actually a female just won, like, winemaker of the year. So what? it's really amazing. Supporting okay. female. I thought it was really rad. We both mm. like wine. We both love supporting females. Yes, so I thought it worked. By the way, this is perfect. It's so good. Do you, do you I drink love on that your you're show here. I don't, well, here's the thing. What? I Tell think me. my people learned yeah. mama's a lightweight. And, <laughs> and like they have, you know, you have your demos. Yeah. Well, I thought at first it was going to be like fake, like water. Nope. Nope, it's real. So everybody brings their like alcohol on and you're like, yeah, I'll try it. And then like literally I'm like hot and I'm like focused. <laughs> I'm like such a lightweight. It's weird. Like no matter how much I drink in life, I will never be able to drink more than one or two glasses. Oh or it's like, hold my hair. And it's <laughs> oh my hair. and it's my husband's worst night ever. <laughs> so but wait, it's you have a new show and you're you and Jenna, you're going in front of a live audience now. Well, we took a page from you. This yeah. is perfect. So Today was yeah. our very first day yeah. of having a live audience. And I have to say, we have, like, I love this vibe. I love the vibe you have on your show. And Jen and I have always said, like, we love our cameramen, Rope and Anthony. We love them. And we yeah, love when they you laugh. you play off of them almost, But there's yeah. something about having, like, our people with us. And energy. Yes. Of it. Yeah. So we've been excited about this. We want to do it five days a week. We're going to start with two yes. just to get it going. And, yes. um, and we're pumped, man. We feel like it's going to be a good thing. I think it's great because... People love you. They love Jenna. They loved you for years on TV, and it's awesome to get give people a chance to be in the same room with you Hang and like feed out. off your energy. And and you're kind of like me. You talk to everyone, yes. and so is Jenna. So yes. you're gonna love it. I can't it's wait. It's so great. I can't wait. Yes, I love. I feed off the energy as well. But how has becoming a mom changed you though? Because you oh. love kids. Now you have your second baby. Yes. You know what, Kelly? It's like, thank you. I keep trying to remember my life before them. Oh. And I can't. It is so, I feel Filled. like it all started. And it was, it's so strange to even think this, but um, I remember the first time someone asked me, I was walking to Dwayne Reed after I had just adopted Haley, and I'd been, my whole life people had asked me the question, do you have children? And I've always said, oh, I have two nieces. And I remembered saying it in my sleep. And I love my nieces. I used to do that too. Oh, my niece and yes. nephew. Yeah, yeah. So I was walking and she said, do you have children? I hadn't really told anybody. And I stopped and I said, I have a daughter. That and you she are looked at me, me right now. <laughs> like, wow. But she looked at me and I said, I have a daughter. I kept repeating it, I have a daughter. And it was so profound to me in that moment. And when we were thinking about whether we should adopt another child, I mean, there are pluses to having children late in life and obviously there are minuses. Um, but I kept thinking, I want someone to hold hands with. I want these two to have someone to hold hands with all the way. Like yeah. they have older parents and I know that that's the way life goes, but I wanna know when they are later on in life, there's somebody who says, I remember. Yeah. Like I remember, yeah. My gosh, yeah. you are seriously yeah. about to make me fall. <laughs> it's 
so beautiful. Yeah. That was, I, we had two older ones, we have two younger ones, and I was like, I hated pregnancy, but I was like, God, I don't want her to be alone. You yes. know, I don't want her, I was alone a lot as a kid, and I was like, I don't want her to do that, you yes, know? Yes, you want Because I'm nuts, and I don't want her to be nuts. So, <laughs> so, but the other news, wait, this is actually fantastic. I have thought you were married this whole time. <laughs> Like, you're newly engaged, and I'm like, oh. congratulations. But I was like, what? Anytime you send me videos yeah. of, like, drinking with your man yeah. or, like, yeah. you're on vacation, yeah. first of all, I'm like, I want your life. And, and then, like, I've, I thought you were married this whole time. Yes. You know what's they funny? They were like, oh, she got engaged. I was like, to another person? Or, like, is she divorced? Like, why? What? You know what, Joel? I met Joel, like, randomly at a book signing one day, one, like, six years ago, and it yeah. was one of those crazy nights that you're so happy you went out. We started dating, and a few years in, I, all I was thinking about was having kids, and I couldn't push it away. And when I asked him, and I brought this up, I said, I can't push it away anymore. I said, I have to ask you this important question. And I, I said, Could, will you explore adoption with me? And literally without blinking, without pausing, he looked at me and he said, yes. Yes, I love yes. Him. So we, I already knew he loved me yeah. that much. So. I kind of didn't care about the married part. I was like, okay, well, we're in love. We have two kids. Like, who cares? It did matter to him, I think, a lot. Yeah. And one day we were at the beach, and it was just the two of us having a mom and dad trip, and he started giving I a... I love mom and dad trips. <laughs> we were having Girl. tequila and churros. We were in Mexico. Girl. I was like, ah, I'm so like, happy. I love an adult trip. And he was kind of giving a little a little like love speech, which he does sometimes. Like, I just, let's talk about where we are. And I love when he does that. And I was like, oh, that's so cute. And I had another tequila and was like licking the, <laughs> and then he was like, and he goes, I really have something important that I'd like to say. I said, yes, I love all of your talks about love. Yes. And I was You're, like, slightly hammered. I was yeah. so happy. <laughs> You're like, yes, I love us. <laughs> and then he kicked the chair out and he got on a oh. knee. And he was, um, he was crying and I was crying and I didn't even, he goes, did you say yes? I said, did you ask? Like, I couldn't, <laughs> it was too much, there was the, but anyway, and in that moment, I thought I'd feel like I did the day before, because I already loved him, mm. but I had no idea how profound yeah. saying something out loud is. Like that. And telling other people. There's something yes. to that as well. Because I was like you. I would, Well, first of all, my mom is still shocked that I'm married <laughs> and have children. So I, I just didn't think that was going to happen. But it's just one of those things that, you know, it didn't matter to me as much as it mattered to my husband. He had kids and he was yes. like, you know, um, and he thought, I, I don't know, I think it's important, you know. And I was like, oh, I'm, I'm cool with it. And then he'd, you know, pop the question one day. But once it does happen, you're like, oh, no, that is different. Yes. It's different than just being together and in love. It's a really yes. cool declaration in front of everyone. And, you know, just a real, like, no, nah, hell no, stay away from my man, you know? <laughs> it's, a nice, it's a nice thing, a ring. You know what? Yeah. It does change. I, yeah. didn't, I didn't know. So we're like, here we go. Look at us. I just love that you've been married in my world for years. <laughs> Years. Well, I was married once before I was like, a while no, ago. No, no, I thought to time. him. Oh, to like, him. Because you send me videos of you on vacation. You're I like, know. I love them. They're the I best know. married couple. By the way, I, I love like... drunk texting Kelly. I like... When we're out, I'm like, hey, Kelly, it's, it's us. Like... It's You're probably favorite. like, what is she doing? No, I have a few friends in the limelight that randomly do that. Pentatonics are one as well. And it's, it's great. great. Yeah, I'm like, oh, y'all should not do this. This is blackmail. <laughs> oh, blackmail. I, like, I never do that. I'm afraid people will show it. Never send that to Blake Shelton. Oh. Yeah. Never. I know you love Blake. But he but will take, trust. he never trust him with something important for What did he do? Did no, he do I, I just don't trust him. <laughs> I will not stop talking until you subscribe to my YouTube channel. That's right, and I can talk a lot. Seriously, not gonna stop. Yep, still here, not going anywhere. I see you. Don't walk away from this.